Hello. It's a beautiful afternoon here at Lawn. I'm sitting in the late winter sun out in our open worship area, uh, just enjoying a little bit of peace and quiet. We've been quite busy over the weekend just gone. We had uh, Lawn Abbey Encounters Group and the Diocese of Peterborough lay ministry folks. We've got Hope Church with us today. We've got uh, some folks from the um, Lincolnshire uh, Methodist District. We've got my colleague Claire Good starting off a quilting and textiles retreat. And in the weeks to come, we've got a lot more individual and uh, church groups coming. We've, uh, we've got Bishop John Stroyan leading the Chosen and Precious retreat. We've got Roy Searle coming to talk about the Celtic Saints. We've got a beginner's retreat. And then looking further ahead, a Lent retreat with Adrian and Jill uh, Chatfield, a retreat with Mona Simpson uh, based on contemplative photography. I'm looking forward to that one. Uh, I'm leading a Holy Week retreat. Alison Myers, our warden, is leading an Easter retreat. And even further ahead than that, uh, we've got retreats uh, around spiritual writing, icon painting, mindfulness, and that's just before June. Uh, second half of the year still to come. So many retreats, and the places are booking up. People are coming for those retreats. Uh, church groups are booking up with us. Uh, individual retreatants are booking up with us. I think that as we emerge after the last two years of pandemic into something that begins to feel a little bit more like normality, a little bit uh, more open, uh, people are enjoying the opportunity to get away and find some space to breathe, which is wonderful. We're enjoying it here. But you know what we're missing? Is you. We'd love to see you at some of these retreats or here for your own individual retreat or, or bringing a small group or bringing your church. So I want to encourage you to have a look around our website, see what's available, and if you're interested, if you want to come and join us, to book soon, because places are disappearing. Everybody seems to want to come, and for us, of course, that's wonderful, but not if it means you miss your chance. So if you're thinking of taking a retreat this spring or this summer, if you're looking ahead and thinking, I want some space to breathe too, then don't hang about. Make sure you get something booked in soon. Get something in your diary to look forward to and make sure you get your space because we're really looking forward to seeing you here too.